Hello, my viewers and subscribers. I want to thank you so much for watching my video again today. Thank you. Thank you for those subscriptions. Thank you for watching, for liking, for sharing, for commenting. Thank you so much. Keep up the good work. Now here we share Chivital Selling Method, the best and the easiest selling method for small and micro businesses. Now, this is Vital Rich Concept. Today, we are going to go into cake packaging. Cake packaging. So if you have if cake making is your passion and you love cake making, what are you still waiting for to turn it to a business, a lucrative business? If you're very good at making cake, it doesn't matter where you are in this world, you can turn your cake making into a lucrative business. So here I'm going to teach you how you can package your cake in a very decent way that anywhere your cake goes, it will be accepted. Okay, now this is a cake I bought from a shop. So this cake in Nigeria, they are sold for 100 Naira. So this is the packaging method the whoever used. So we are going to do our own packaging now. Okay, so I cut the cake. So the first thing you're going to do, but before I start, I want to show you the items we need. We need our mini hand sealer, both the line surface mini hand sealer, the smooth surface mini hand sealer. You need your cake you want to package, your cupcake. Then you need your nylon, a branded nylon for your packaging. You can also use unbranded if you want. Okay, but these are the nylons and they are available for you. You know, we can deliver them to you anywhere you are just to help you make sure you start up your business. Okay, the first thing you're going to do is, okay, these ones are also available. The land, the hand sealer, the mini hand sealers and the nylons, they are all available for you to, you place your order and you, we can deliver them to you anywhere so that you can start up your business. So now the first thing I'm going to do is to get the, 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 the width of the cake. Now to measure the width of the cake, no, this is a cupcake. So to measure the width, the width, you put your tape here, then you go around like this, you go around like this, you see? So can you see the width? The width of the cake is six and a half inches. Six and a half inches. That is the width of the cake. Now, to get the height of the cake, you start from the middle, the middle, you know, the middle like this, you go around like this, you stop at the middle of the other side. You can see. It gave me four inches, four inches. So the height is four inches. The, the width is six and a half inches. So what next? So the next thing you're going to do, you go to your nylon, you cut it out. You, you know, for this nylon, this nylon is seven and a half inches height. That is from here to here is seven and a half inches. The width of the cake is 6.5 inches. So we add extra one inch to it to make it 7.5 inches. Why the, the length of the nylon of the cake is four inches so we add extra one inch to make it five inches remember our nylon roll is 7.5 inches so that has taken care of the width already the height for our cake is, uh, is uh, five inches while the width for our cake is seven and a half inches okay so the next thing you're gonna do you go to nylon i told you that this nylon from here to here is seven and a half inches so you cut it out you know this one serves as the width of the nylon already so since it's already seven and a half inches, so what you're going to do next, you cut out, you cut out, uh, you measure out, uh, what do they call it? You measure out five inches, then you cut it out. So let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. So this is a nylon. Okay. So I said that from here to here, if I measure it now, you see that the, the height of this nylon is seven and a half inches. So you can see it. It's seven and a half inches. So it already serves the width of your cake. So all you need to do now is to measure five inches from here. So you measure five inches from here, serving as the, the length of the cake or the height. You know, you now cut it, use your scissors and cut it out from here. But I've already done that here. So I've done that here, so I don't need to cut it again. So I've done that here. So I don't need to cut it again. So this is it. Vital rich cake. Simply delicious. 20 grams. So these are the simple package, the simple branding I did. Now remember. If you want to brand your cake, you just go and get my course on how to print on your nylon. So I will I will leave the link in the description section so you can go and get the course and understand how to print on your packaging nylon. It doesn't matter what you want to print on your packaging nylon. That course is a full video that will teach you how you're going to do that. So by the time you get the course and you now, so after cutting, the next thing you print on your nylon. You print your brand on your nylon if you want to print your brand on your nylon. Okay, now. The next thing you're going to, so remember, don't forget our measurements. Don't forget that from here to here is seven and a half inches, which is already the height of the nylon itself. And from here to here is uh, five inches. So you can see it. Everything is clear for you to see. So the, the next thing you're going to do, you fold it into two equal parts. Okay. You fold it into two equal parts. 
all right then because here we're going to be using back ceiling back ceiling so when you put it make sure the two the two sides are equal okay then you would have plugged your ceiling machine for a long time so it will be heating up remember this machine it feels very hot it's only this kind of nylon that can stand it all these other normal nylon cannot stand the heat that comes out from this machine so now when you're sealing please seal less than half inch at the back because you made another ones of one inch one inch and each part if let's say you say five half inch here and half inch at the back that means it has consumed that one inch allowance you added so it's better for you to seal half inch here or less than but please don't seal more than half inch if you seal more than half inch the cake will not enter inside the nylon so i'm going to just seal less than half inch i'm going to seal something small so that i will not have any issue adding my cake inside the nylon just small something you remove here you see i've said like let's say what i sealed is less than quarter so you can it's, it's like water quarter inch you can see it you can see okay so i i when you fold it like this you're creating a center here the center so if this is the front part of the packaging this is the back because i didn't back sell it so the next thing you're going to do you fold it like this let this back align with this center in the front so that your 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 item will be at the center it won't be one-sided you can see they have aligned they have just aligned okay that's the next step you align them and fold the nylon is prepare the nylon in such a way that your cake will enter then you add your cake yeah, you add your cake. You can see our cake. Vital rich cake. Vital rich cake. You can see our cake. We've added it. Make sure the cake is well positioned. That is at the center. Okay. Then the next thing you're going to do, you seal one end. With the lined surface sealer. See, you. in case you don't understand, these two sealers are doing two different jobs. This one is... So here, you make sure you seal half inch. Remember, in the height, you give one inch allowance. So you seal half inch. You can see half inch here and half inch the other side okay so this is your cake then make sure the cake is at the center now i'm going to cut off some a little portion here so it will be equal it's not very smooth so when you have such a case use your scissors and cut it and make it equal so everything should be equal and smooth so but remember don't cut too much so that it will not affect your measurement okay you can see now it's equal and it's smooth okay so i'm gonna seal another half inch use this so it will make your it will make your item to look beautiful it will make it look like like uh, it's like a factory sealed product you can see it voila this is our cake so this is vital rich cake you can see it is it not looking like company sealed cake this is a back ceiling which is you see when you use a smooth surface to see here it makes it to look just like back ceiling and you use the the line surface to see here it makes it to look just like back ceiling can you see our cake see how lovely and beautiful your cake is so whatever design you have you make it here any kind of design you wish you put it at the front there you can see our cake see check out the back the back ceiling now if you bring out this cake this this packaging and bring out this packaging which one are you going to choose definitely you choose this packaging so i'm telling you that as for any other small business in your category when you bring out your products in the market in, wherever they are, they are they are being sold and your product your product will definitely sell fast because of your ceiling and your packaging you can see this is why i love chivital ceiling method yeah. yeah so this is how you're going to seal your cupcake this is how you're going to see your cupcake so remember for the branding of your cake you get my course i said i'm going to put the link the link for the course in the description section so you go there you click the link it will show you the overview of the course you know give you an overview of the, of the course then you can get the course so you can learn how to print your label on your packaging nylon it doesn't matter what you want to print on the packaging nylon the, the, the cake the course will show you and that course the materials you, need, you don't need a printer the materials you need they are very cheap and very easy in our everyday market so with those material and with my course you will learn how to print on your nylon by yourself so thank you for watching out my video remember these materials are available for you the nylon and the mini sealer that is the essence of us making them available is to help you to practice what you're learning from this video so that you can you know you practice it at home see that it is working and then start up your business fully and begin to generate income so you can contact us for any of these items so that we can they can be delivered to you thank you very much do have a lovely day